Hey, what's up, gang? Pretty too. Long time no see. I uh, haven't really found uh, any hot sauces worth talking about. And, uh, yeah, I just haven't been on it. So, these will happen when they happen. If there's going to be three a year, there'll be three a year. If there's going to be 30 a year, there's going to be 30 a year. That's just the way it goes. So, anyway, with that out of the way, I did find something uh, that... Uh, got my interest it's not a hot sauce these are habanero onions this is a broken taco honky tonk habanero onions show you the label kind of a cool cool label sugar skull with the uh fedora hat looks like a bullet hole in the hat it's pretty cool uh let's see the company here is gaiu gaiolano probably saying that wrong but i don't give a shit Oh boy, look at this, uh, you know, they all have the, what do you call it, the heat scale, and they usually put funny names, though. ooh, this one's real original, uh, safe space, hmm. trigger warning, offensive, almost illegal, and hell no, so this one comes in between offensive and, uh, or no, right at the line of almost illegal, so, hmm. real cool, uh, yeah, real cool. Anyway, uh, pretty uh, pretty basic stuff. Uh, obviously, onions, water, distilled vinegar, salt, habanero, calcium chloride, soybean oil, oregano, sodium, uh, sodium bisphite. Never heard of that one. Uh, lime juice. So comes out of California obviously refrigerate after opening so anyway I was at the grocery store um, sometime last week different grocery store than the one I normally go to and um, the label you know obviously popped out of me I like the name broken taco that's pretty cool um, their, uh, their heat scale that's pretty lame uh, trademark license from sticky fingers Norge AS don't know what that means so anyway, whatever. Habanero onions, that's pretty cool. Um, I like habanero, I like onions. And it's not a hot sauce, which is cool. Um, obviously, channel is, you know, like 90% hot sauce. But finding items like this, I feel like this is where I'm starting to gravitate to. Is away from hot sauces and more stuff like this, like food items. Um, so yeah, if you see anything cool... Um, I still check the Instagram every once in a while, which is Greedy Teat, all one word. And then also the Facebook page. You can uh, you can send me a message there, and uh, I'll be sure to get it. Ooh. Definitely uh, <laughs> oniony, which makes sense. So, you know, before I eat one, I just want to show you. It doesn't look any, you know, any different. It's a regular white onion. Um, they really, they really pack them in. So I'm curious to see how they taste um, raw versus cooked. So I'll probably cook some up later with dinner, just to uh, just to see. Let me get another one, then I'll give uh, thoughts and opinions. I feel like you gotta have a little bit more than just that initial one. So again, diced really well, or not diced, chopped well. Mmm. Right off the bat, um, having them out of the the jar here, I think dicing these up with your um, your salsa. Or your um, onion and cilantro for your tacos. This should be phenomenal. I'm cu really curious to see um, how much of the heat retains when they're cooked. I wonder if it'll cook it all out, but I'll find that out later. I could definitely just eat these by themselves like a snack. Um, yeah, your label system is way off. If these are almost illegal, 
I hate to uh, try to imagine what the illegal is. Now, sometimes when stuff gets pickled, try as hard as you might to keep the flavor in. I've noticed some companies will pickle hot stuff, and um, it was probably a lot hotter uh, when they pickled it. I'm actually looking. You probably won't be able to see it. Oh, well, there you go. Pretty decent. Um, that's orange there. So I'm wondering, that looks like... Yeah, it just says habanero. So there's probably, there's probably like one habanero in the bottom of this. And then that's generating the little bit of heat off the top. Maybe. Um, I guess I won't find out until, well, honestly, by the weekend. Because uh, these are just good to snack on. But anyway, the heat is... Um, for habanero stuff, which I think for the average person, a habanero is, um, that's pretty much hitting the average person's mark for hot, hot. I could be wrong, but just an assumption. Um, uh, what was I saying? Anyway, I think there's like one habanero in there. So it's making the heat relatively low. I would put this at like, I don't know, do like a two, two and a half, maybe. It's not hot. It's good though. Um, the logo's cool the name is cool um they taste good that's what's more important than anything i don't care if something is incredibly hot if it doesn't taste good then why the hell why would we want it um so anyway so it's really good um check them out if you see them this was a local grocery store the one i go to is not a um it's not a mom and pop place it's a, it's a chain it's local to my area but um again broken taco um See if you can't find it. Try it for yourself. Um, if anybody comes across anything else that they pickle, um, habanero pickled, whatever, uh, I'll give it a whirl. And um, we will uh, try to get back on track. Um, when they happen, they happen. And uh, so thanks for watching. And we'll see you, well, we'll see you when you see it.